Hey everybody, Alan here. So today I'll be reviewing the Asus ZenBook Pro UX 550VE. I'm actually just gonna review the performance of it. This is mostly towards the the creator side, the creator side of it, which means people who love to do uh, photography, videography, filmmaking, any of that sort. Anyways. This laptop performs very well with Lightroom and uh, Photoshop, but let's see how it, how well it performs on the on the on Premiere Pro. Okay, so for here, let's get started. For here, I'll just add some geometry color to each of the clips. Here, let's see. Contrast. Here, let's make it a little bit bigger. Let's bring this just a little bigger. Over here. Basically, it's playing with this clip. Let's make it. Let's bring down the shadows. Bring down the highlights. I mean, bring up the whites. Over here. We'll make it 5, maybe 95. And a little bit more contrast over here. Let's play with this. Which clip is it going? Okay, it's playing with this clip. Let's bring down the blacks. Or let's bring down the shadows. Over here, next clip. Playing with this. Looks pretty good. Over here, last clip. Make it brighter a little bit. Okay, so far so good. So far, I went through the Lumetri color pretty fast. Now let's play it. Let's see if it. Uh, it, let's see if it hangs or lags. Over here. So far, a little, only a little lag. But one thing that will fix it is. When you render it in to out in, I'll put this in to out. Render into out. Basically, I'm just uh for this performance test. I'm not gonna look into any numbers to you know look at the speed of the GPU or anything. I'm just gonna do a do a real world performance on this. And as you can see, as you're seeing right now. Over here, let's play it again. And it looks pretty good. All I did was apply the Lumetri color. Oh yeah, and uh, one thing is these are all 4K clips. One, two, three, four. And this is also a uh, 4K timeline. Okay, so let's do more tests. Let's just copy and paste this. Control C, go over here. Let's make like 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Over here. Let's play it back. So far, it's looking, it's looking pretty good. So far, no hanging or lagging. Yeah, it looks pretty good. No hanging, lagging, slowing down. The performance of the laptop is pretty soft. It's strong, actually. So, let's step it up a little bit. Let's copy this again. Copy. Let's see. Yep. Still strong, still strong. Okay, let's add some effects now. Just go in effects, sorry in effects. Let's do Gaussian blur. Okay, you. There you go, JUS. Gaussian blur. Let's put it in every single clip. 
Actually, let's work with these. These now. Gaussian blur. What Gaussian blur does is it blurs out, it blurs out the images. And it's also uh, taxing on the taxing on the laptop. So let's play with it. Over here. Gaussian blur. Blur it out. You can use this effect. If you want some bokeh or if you want something kind of unwanted you can just use a point and like you, let's say if you don't want this rock you just make a point and you can blur it out selective blurring okay um okay so let's move on over here we'll add some gaussian blur over here Gaussian blur over here Gaussian blur over here Gaussian blur and let's add one more hi over here Gaussian blur okay now let's Play the clips. So far, let's make it bigger. Let's play till the end. Yeah, so far it looks pretty damn good. It's uh, still going strong. I added Gajum Blur to some of the clips. Now let's add some Dip 2s. I usually like to use the dip twos. Dip two. These are, this is a video transition. Dip two. Dip two. Dip two. Dip two. And let's add some music. I think there's the music. Over here. Over here, let's see how it goes. Over here, I'm not rendering it. Let's see if it plays good. Let's see the playback. If, it's, if you see any choppiness or lag. Mm. Okay, now you actually see. Now you actually see some choppiness and lag. So. What I would do now is, I would just render it, render in to out, and I, and for this I'm actually using my external hard drive. It's a 3.0. It's not an SSD. It's just a regular hard drive. And for the OBS, let's see my settings. Settings. I have the output to recording. 30,000 so that might be a little bit taxing to the laptop system what was this bring this down so we'll render this into out so let's check it out this might take a little while but I'm not too sure sometimes it takes a while but it really doesn't so let's see Okay, so that took about three minutes of the render in to render out time. So let's see, let's see the playback of this. Let's see if there's any choppiness hanging or lagging. Yeah, it looks pretty good so far. All right, let's keep going. Let's wait, let's see. And keep in mind, all these files is in uh, 4K, so you know that 4K is very taxing on 
laptops and the computers and so far this laptop is handling this these clips pretty damn good it's handling it pretty strong okay well and it's done and I believe I taxed out the system or I tried to tax out the system but this laptop is strong anyways I think that might be it and that's it for the video